how to solve computations involving the mean, sample size, and sum of a data set. Number one, look at what we already know from the problem. Number two, decide if we need to divide, multiply, add, or subtract. And number three, solve the problem. Lastly, number four, check to see if it makes sense. So now that we already know how to solve the problem and the steps, let's actually have a question. So a book has 12 chapters. The mean length of the chapters is 38 pages. How many total pages are there in the 12 chapters? Step number one is to look at what we already know from the problem. What do we already know? We know that a book has 12 chapters. We also know the mean equals 38 pages. And we know that we are trying to find the total pages in all chapters. Okay. Number two, decide if we need to divide, multiply, add, or subtract. So if we already know the mean, and we know the mean is one chapter, so I'm gonna write that down, that's important. Mean equals one chapter. And we're trying to find all 12 chapters. We are going to multiply 38 by 12 or it could be 38 plus 38 plus 38 plus 38 on for 12 times but I think it's easier to do 38 times 12 so I'm doing 38 times 12 because there's 12 chapters 38 is the average of one chapter and we're trying to find the total pages. So we're going to do 38, which is the pages for 1, times 12. 38 times 12, let's solve this. 8 times 2 is 16. 3 times 2 is 6, plus 1 is 7, and that is 0. 8 times 1 is 8. 3 times 1 is 3. Add them together, and we get 456. 456 is our answer and our unit is going to be total pages or just pages and the last step is number four check to see if it makes sense we can round 38 to 40 and we can round 12 to 10 40 times 10 equals 400. And is that close to 456? Yes, it is. So 456 is our answer to problem number one. Question number two. On her sixth test, Maria earned a total of 510 points. What was her mean number of points earned per test? The important information in this is her sixth test, 510 points, and her mean number of points earned per test. Now we are going to decide if we are going to multiply, divide, subtract, or add. I'm gonna draw this out to give us a better understanding of which one. So here are the six tests. And here is the 510 points. This one plus 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 this one equals 510. And we're trying to find the number that's gonna be in each of this. So we're going to divide. We're going to divide 510 divided by 6 to get the answer for all of the red. I got the answer of 85. 510 divided by 6 equals 85. So that is going to be our missing number for all of these. 85 plus 85 plus 85 plus 85 plus 85 plus 85 equals 510. Or we could do 85 times 6 equals 510. Now we're going to ask ourselves, does this make sense? Yeah, it does make sense because the test could be 85 points. I hope you learned something. Thanks for watching.